Welcome back to Burning River Bushcraft. Today we're going to be opening up the Grim Workshop Tool of the Month Club for October. If you're not already subscribed to the Grim Workshop Tool of the Month or you've never heard of this before, this is one of the better deals in a monthly subscription service. You don't have to commit to this ahead of time. This is available the entire month of October. So if you see the video here, I'm always going to have the video up first and you see something you'd like and something you'd buy anyway, this is usually double the value from what you're actually spending. So this is a heck of a deal, and I love the fact that you don't have to commit. If you order this on the 10th, each month it's gonna recur and reorder on the 10th. If you watch my video early and you can pass on that month, you can cancel. Just cancel that month and pick it up again next time. You'll always see the current Tool of the Month Club right here. If this is the kind of thing you like to see, go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave me a comment in the comment box, and ring the bell to be notified of my latest videos. You can also find me on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook at Burning River Bushcraft. I also teach outdoor classes at OutdoorCore.com. If you want to get in on this, if you want to sign up for the Tool of the Month Club, or you just see one item that you specifically want to have, I am a Grim Affiliate. Go ahead and look in my description box. You will see my affiliate code. Head over to Grim and check them out today. So the first thing out of the envelope, this is a banded wrap. So this is a gear organizer. This is elastic and it has loops around it. I've got one of these and I keep it around my grill water bottle. So with those loops, you can put a flashlight, you can put ferro rod, you can put a multi-tool, all kinds of different smaller items. Uh, it lets you kind of stay a little more organized, especially when you're using a haversack or a bigger bag. You can slip this around your water bottle and it's a lot easier to find small items. So next thing out of the envelope, I'm seeing a monster notebook. So this kind of goes along with the Halloween theme, just keeping things fun, keeping things light. It would be pretty slick to pull one of these out of the survival class and jot down notes, put your coordinates down on it. You would definitely stand out for sure, but that's neat. Next item out of the envelope, this is the Jordan Jonas Signature 2 card. So Jordan Jonas, he won one of the seasons of Alone, and Jordan's actually got two signature cards. So this is a nice card. He's got a Paiute Deadfall on here. There's a serrated arrow. There's a netting needle. He's got fishing hooks, spinners, and all a couple different size needles. So this is a nice card. This card right here is worth more than the cost of the envelope this month so kind of keep that in mind so if you like the jordan jonas card and we're thinking about getting that anyway this costs around 22 dollars, and then you got to pay for shipping so right here you just paid for your monthly subscription so pretty cool card i've uh i've used this card in the past actually and that paiute trap is pretty slick so there's usually one bigger item and that was it i've got i've got a knife here this is pretty cool. This is not something that is on our website. This is nothing that I've seen before. So when I reference the paper with it, this is just an Altoid 10 size carbon steel knife. So that's pretty cool. I'm pretty big into the Altoid size 10 survival kits. That's kind of how I got hooked up with Grimm in the first place. And this is not an item that you can just go to the website, click and buy. I'm not sure what the history on this is. I'm not sure if this is something they were going to add maybe. But if you want one of these, you've got to be a Tool of the Month Club member to get it. So I'll probably open this up and do a short video on this on TikTok or YouTube shorts. I'm kind of interested in, in the design of the knife and how useful it is. But I'm a pretty big fan of Altoid 10 size knives anyway. I've got a tip card here. So these tip cards are the size of a deck of playing cards and they're kind of waterproof. And this one is on how to regrow onions. So the front of these tip cards is usually pictorial based and then on the back it goes into a lot more detail. Now a lot of this information, if you've got a pretty decent survival library, you may have this already. I don't believe I have this information, but if you want to go out and practice this, you can just take one of these cards and slip in your shirt pocket and go out and work on that one skill or develop that one skill. And when you have learned this, that's a great way to just pass this card on to somebody and pass that information along. So pretty slick. 
So I got one more item in here. And this is another tip card on the Swedish log fire. So these go by a lot of different names. Swedish stoves, Swedish torches, I've seen them as. Pretty slick. Again, pictorial on the front. Goes into a lot more detail on the back. I've made these before. It's a heck of a way to uh, have a controlled fire if you're just trying to cook a lunch or something. But if you have not used this yet, this card will get you started for sure. So when I opened up the Jonas Jordan card, I was familiar with the cost of that one. The signature cards are right around $22. So I knew right there we hit our $20 value. But for a quick breakdown of everything that's in this kit, uh, the Jordan Jonas card was $21.95. The Bandit Wrap was $10.95. The small Altoids 10 knife was $7.99, and then the tip cards were $1.85 a piece, and we had two of those. So for your $20, you got $44.59 worth of gear. And again, if you like this, just order it. Use my affiliate link, order it right now, you get the same value. You don't have to pre-buy this in September to get October's kit, and then that's a surprise. Watch it here first. Sign up and buy this gear. This is a heck of a value. Outstanding box this month. I've used a lot of these items personally. I've used this Bandit Tool Organizer on a couple of my trips. This Jordan Jonas signature card, I've used that one as well. Uh, the trap is pretty cool. The serrated arrowhead is kind of unique. Most of the arrowheads are non-serrated. And we've got spinner weights, I'm sorry, we got spinner blades, and then these small circles here are fishing weights. So, kind of slick. Definitely worth the cost right here. This is something you can just add right to your wallet, and you're going to be a lot more prepared than if you didn't have it. What is all that uh, tools without a little bit of knowledge? So, these tip cards will help you build your internal library on skills that you know. And then, I'm really excited about this little guy. I have, uh, I have a lot of Altoid 10 size knives. I make uh, my own style of Altoid 10 size knife. But this was kind of cool. Looks like it's a one finger knife. I can definitely probably hook a lanyard to this and kind of get it around my finger. But I will definitely do more on this knife in the future. So until next time, this has been Jamie Boggs with Burning River Bushcraft. See you soon. Mm -hmm.